Hey guys, this is Eric with Cobb Tuning. Just wanted to put together a quick video that will show you how to modify our OTS maps for some of the more popular intakes on the market. The EVO platform is very sensitive to changes made to the intake system, so you will need to make the correct adjustments in the tune to ensure the vehicle operates safely and performs as desired. Since the EVO uses both a map sensor and a map sensor to determine how much air is entering the engine, you will need to make changes to both the math scaling table as well as a few load calculation tables. We have done extensive testing on a number of different aftermarket intakes and have come up with the correct values that should ensure your car runs safely and performs correctly after you install the intake. This data is located under the support tab of the CobbTuning.com homepage. So if you go to support, click on Mitsubishi, it's located here under the Evo X intake calibration spreadsheet. First thing you'll want to do is you'll want to open up the Axis Tuner race program as shown on my screen. If you don't have this program yet, you can download it off the Cobb Tuning website for free. Once you have the program open, you'll want to load the correct OTS map for your particular set of modifications. Once that has loaded, you'll need to open up the folders that contain the tables we will be modifying. You'll start by clicking on Base Tables, then you'll click on Load Calculation Tables, and these three tables here are going to be the ones we'll be modifying. You can also go ahead and open up the sensor calibrations folder and math sensor folder and the math scaling table will also be the table we'll be modifying. Once you have the tables open, you'll want to copy and paste the values located in the spreadsheet we opened up earlier. So for the math sensor scaling, we'll want to go to the spreadsheet we opened up earlier, find the intake that we're going to be using. We'll use engine intake for this example and we'll want to copy all of the value located in this spreadsheet. Hit Control C to copy, and then we can paste that directly into Active Tuner. You can see that the graph has changed slightly, and that if you scroll down, the colors of the numbers have changed in the table. That signifies that the values have been changed. We're going to do the same for the load calculation tables. We've set this up for where all intakes use the exact same load calculation numbers. So each intake will all use the same load calculation numbers located in this section here. So we'll copy it from here. And we're going to go ahead and paste it into these each individual tables. All of these tables are going to contain the same values. So you will paste it in each three of these. Once you have that done, you'll just want to resave your map, change the name. That way you can determine uh, the new modified map from the existing OTS calibration. Put that on your access port and flash it onto the car. The only difference is going to be for customers with 2008 GSR or MR cars. Those cars are going to be missing one column. So the table size in that model year is different. You'll do the exact same thing, except for you'll skip the first column and you'll only copy from here over. And that's pretty much it. This should get the car up and running and driving around, performing correctly and safely uh, with the aftermarket intake and the correct set of modifications for the OTS map you'll be using. Hope this video was helpful. And uh, if you have any more questions, you can email us and we'll uh, help walk you through this process.